hello and welcome to another exciting tutorial and today we're going to be exploring the best python gui libraries whether you're a beginner or an experienced developer these libraries promise to revolutionize application development process in python programming so without any further ado let's get started first we have the custom tick enter the tick enter library has been around for ages and it is still a favorite among developers due to its simplicity and ease of use with custom tick enter library you can create modern gui applications quickly and efficiently now for those of you that prefer a visual approach to gui development in python or simply you want to make your workflow very easy then you can use the tick enter designer as a game changer so all you need to do is to create your software design in figma using drag and drop and then use the tick enter designer tool to convert your app into actual python code using this method you won't write even a single line of code because it's 100% drag and drop and the code will be automatically generated for you. So if you are interested in learning how to harness the power of Tick and Tad Designer to build modern GUI apps, be sure to check out the tutorial linked in the video description below. Next, we have the PyQt framework. This is actually a powerful GUI toolkit that is used to create a wide variety of applications in Python, including desktop applications, mobile apps, and embedded systems. So to get started with PyQt, you will need to install the PyQt package, which can be easily done using the pip command. Once you are done installing PyQt, you can start creating your PyQt applications using your favorite code editor or IDE. Another cool aspect about PyQt is that it also offers a convenient drag and drop feature through the Qt Designer software, which makes it easy for developers to prioritize visual aspects in developing their applications. And these apps could also be both mobile or desktop applications. Moving forward, we have the Kiwi library. This is actually my favorite framework because it enables developers to create dynamic modern interfaces. With Kiwi, you can build both Android and iOS applications, also including desktop softwares. However, Kiwi extends beyond building applications. It is also compatible with embedded devices like Raspberry Pi and more. So whether you are a beginner or just getting started, you can choose Kiwi because it offers a welcoming environment with extensive documentation and a supportive community. So the possibilities are just endless. Lastly, we have Pygame. While Pygame is best known as a library for game development in Python, it can also be used to create interactive multimedia applications and simulations. It provides functionalities for handling graphics, sounds and user input making it a great option for GUI development in Python. So in conclusion, this Python GUI library stands as a guiding of creativity for Python developers, which gives you a lot of options no matter where you are on your Python journey. So whether you are making a smooth desktop apps or exciting mobile applications, there is always a library that is just right for what you need. So see you next time and as always, take care.